check Nikon D7000, bit of a clean. Uh, what happened was um, I used some cotton buds and the fluff got, there's a black, as you can see, you can see the mirror and you can see the uh, up into the viewfinder, right? Uh, so I'll take the mirror up in a second, but um, there's a kind of a, it's a very fine, uh, like a felt, uh, it's black felt around the mirror, I don't know, you can just kind of see it there. Uh, let me just get the camera in the light. I'll get some focus in a second. I'm just using my phone now. Just a pair of scissors. That there, which is kind of the box, it's the hole inside of the. Uh, that that there is covered. A, you can actually see a tiny bit of fluff right there. Now there was actually quite a bit of it in there. I, could, I there was so much I couldn't get it off the. Um, off the viewfinder, the top of the viewfinder, which is that there, which is an opaque, an opaque glass, and that throws it up into your eye. The mirror throws the image onto it's the mirror. It's hard to kind of keep it in the light. It's the mirror. You see it reflecting now. That throws it up onto the opaque glass of the viewfinder into your eye. And as soon as we hit the button to take a photo, it should pop up. Very good. Now the mirror's up out of the road. What you see now is not the sensor, that is the front of the shutter curtain. And I'm not going anywhere near that, that's a, it's a, like a rubbery membrane that uh, opens in very short or very long spaces of time. I mean it's quite strong, it's good for, it's good for, a norm, there we go, it just popped open, I had it on uh, long exposure and that is the sensor. I'll just get the LED lights off. And I've got a little light panel just over my head. Get the lights out of it. That is the sensor, which is, uh, yeah, the most important part of the whole camera, really, I guess. Um, and there we go, it just closed up. So the mirror pops up. Voila, shutter curtain, and you can see this black velvet inside the D7000. There we go. And what I had to do was actually, to get that out, I had to actually vacuum it. What I did, and be careful not to suck the shutter curtain out of your uh, camera, well, actually, here we go. That is the sensor, and that is spotless. So I don't need to clean that. What it was, there was just this. You can see particles of it there. It's hard to keep her get the get the right light and what have you. But anyway, it's surrounded by this kind of fluff, and it traps. It traps, uh, the, if you use a cotton bud, you've got to be careful because it, there we go. So let's, there we go. And that white stuff is what I've been uh, vacuuming out of there. Just being very careful not to, uh, what I did, I'll show you, is uh, made a little extension pipe for my, for the end of the vacuum. And the vacuum cleaner uh, has a kind of a minimum on it, so you don't want to 
you don't want to be uh, you need a vacuum with uh, like a minimum suction power and I just made a small uh, a small extension for it I'm just slowly vacuuming that stuff out um, just got my light panel kind of jerry rig taped up onto my tripod over the top of over the top of my camera so I can see what I'm doing and the main thing is the sensors spotless uh, the rest I've kept cleaning it and this fluff from the from the uh, from the you can see it there from this felt it's just coated in this fluff and the more I kind of clean the camera the worse it got and I couldn't figure it out and it's coming off the cotton buds so now I uh, now I'll use now I'll use just a lint lint free um, kind of cloth Nice bit of noise, but that is actually very, very clean. It's a bit like home dentistry. Uh, I've seen. Uh, I don't see anything wrong with what's uh, what I've done. Um, just the reverse of blowing it out, I suppose. I mean, uh, as long as you don't uh, run it all up and down the mirror, it's pretty good. Everything's pretty fine. There's no dust in there. I can see that. Sensor's spotless. See the LEDs. Now I've just got a... It's just a regular uh, mar uh, microfiber, I think, uh, from the... From the from your glasses when you buy your your eyeglasses uh, it's a super super fine cloth oh, I wouldn't use cotton buds again after that so uh, anyway that's how I've cleaned my camera and it's pretty clean and if we can look through the viewfinder the viewfinder but uh, I doubt it I doubt it maybe Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad.